Hey guys, Jeff here, and today I wanted to give a shout out to a channel that really feels like a kindred spirit to me, and that is Beer Can Bushcraft. Um, found out about him a fair while back now, and I was looking back through his videos, and it looks like he started doing picking videos. He does some other things like bushcraft, but his picking videos seem to have started about nine months ago. Now, one of the things that has really drawn me to beer, beer can bushcraft is the fact that he keeps things very down to earth. He does a lot of DIY, which you guys know when it comes to picking tools, DIY is huge for me. And he, uh, he, he just picks a lot of interesting locks, and he seems to care about his subscribers. With that, I should mention, he has just recently hit 100 subscribers. I'm looking forward to him making it all the way up to 200 sometime soon. So, of course, if you haven't already, you should go over and check him out, add to his subscriber list. Um, but as far as some of my favorite videos... Uh, one of the first ones of his that I actually ran across was this, um, the video number 10, Bushcrafting a Key from a Beer Can. The name's actually a little um, deceitful, throws you off a little bit. He actually uses a tab from a beer can to make a little pick. Now, I actually asked him told him about some thoughts I had from that about a whole keyring pick set, which led to him making this video with another little keyring type pick. He's just, I've seen not only for myself, but for many of his other subscribers and commenters, he is very interactive with the people that follow him. He will respond to your comments. He will make videos answering your questions. Um, for me, he also answered a question because he has this really great wooden hand clamp that he made. He's used it in several videos. And so in video number 41, he actually described exactly how he made this from just some simple pieces of scrap. But he goes through the steps, talks about how he did it, just to uh, just to answer my question. Really great guy. Um, he's also, from what I can see, he seems to follow Brummy Lockpicker, which I know that I've commented about before, and makes some of the similar tools as in his uh, the tools right here in his video number nine for attacking some lever locks. And lastly, I just wanted to point out his video number 33, rummaging through a toolbox just to see some of the great old locks that he ends up with. Now, being from England, he does pick lever locks in addition to pin tumblers, but overall, just a really great down-to-earth channel. If you haven't heard of him before, I hope you will check him out. Check out these videos here that I've mentioned. Um, give him... A subscription and if you end up over there let him know that you heard about him from Jeff and things um, if you have a favorite video of his that I haven't mentioned please leave that in the comments below and I'll talk to you folks later